Hey YouTube, this is Anthony23 back with another video. Thank you for stopping by. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. So if you also want to follow me on IG, it's going to be YouTube and underscore Anthony23. YouTube underscore Anthony23 for some content as well. Um, just wanted to let you know I'm going to be doing a video about my new balances I just picked up not too long ago. It's one of my favorite new balances for this year, for 2022. And it's going to be the Daytonas, the Air Max 9. 990s the v3s and personally i love them to death i've been rocking them so far so they're very comfortable and i'm going to talk about the comfort the sizing uh the materials of the shoe and the inspiration behind it and let you know um how can you get your hands on them as well so first off i just want to let you know that the sneaker is right here bada bing bada boom and take a good look at that i'm going to do some more um in-depth uh, shots later on in the video so stay tuned to it towards the end of the video so you can see more of a detailed look of this sneaker and all the accessories that it comes with um but for right now i just want to show you this uh 360 of the shoe so you can see like the, the suede that they used um very very premium quality on this sneaker very impressed very impressed i haven't had like a really nice premium sneaker in a minute All right, so let me get down to the sizing. So sizing, first off, so these are the 990s uh, V3s. So you can go true to size or half a size down. So I prefer going a half a size down. I like mine more of like a, a true fit. Uh, I know the 990s, they do have a wider toe box and it could be a little extra room depending on your foot is narrow or wide, um, but you can go true to size on them or even a half a size down. Um, a friend of mine has a pair of these and he gave me the heads up before I bought my pair and he said he went down, uh, he said he preferred to going down a size because he ended up getting his true to size so I went straight to the half a size and I actually if it's perfect for me I'm glad I went with my half a size down but also you can get a true to size fit and it would fit perfectly probably a little extra room in the toe box but true to size have a size down you're a-okay um, cool thing about this this is a sneaker that's like inspired by an old uh, old colorway that came back out I think it was like the I think the 1600 New Balances and they came out in 13 that they came out and it was a old school colorway. This is the colorway they had and it was called Daytona. I'm going to leave it right over here on a picture of showing you the, the old school one that came out in 2013 and they brought this colorway back uh, for 2022. Uh, 22, so... I don't know what tell me what's your thoughts about this sneaker do you like the colorway um it's a very nice sneaker to me personally i like the colorway it's very nice especially like the the rope laces i don't know if you guys remember back in the days like everyone used to have like these little rope laces and they used to wear them around um their wrists and it had like the green ones the pink ones the blue ones and they were like back in the days in school like everybody would wear like the little like like I don't know like wristbands of these um, that's what it reminds me of it reminds me of back in the days when like everyone used to wear like little like bands and they were like something similar to this um, the quality of the shoe very nice very buttery like you you can brush it and it'll change like you can see that I'm gonna go up with it and you can see how like how clean that looks and then you just you could like literally put my initial on there let's see or I tried, but but you can do that. You can see how it changes. Um, very delicate, very premium. Same thing here. Um, one thing I would definitely say, um, this part here would get dirty. Just be careful. Just, you know, like look at the forecast when you're wearing these because you would hate to wear these on a rainy day and it will get ruined and it's kind of like difficult to clean. Um, this suede here is very light and very delicate. Um, I do like how it has this pink um, New Balance symbol here. Very vibrant. It, you know, it's very like pops. You can see it from far. Um, the tongue's pretty cool too. It's very thick and it says New Balances right there with the pink inliner. It says the New Balances USA. Um, has like this um, silk. Nope. What's it called? Yeah, I think it's like, like a silk in, in liner as well in blue. You have your uh, New Balance uh, 990s. These are the V3s. 
and then it has like a carbon fiber on the bottom. They're a little dirty. I wore them already. I couldn't resist, but it has a carbon fiber on the bottom. But this is a nice looking sneaker. They look good on feet. Very summer shoe. Like going to the beach, rocking these, having the right type of outfit. It will look a nice, it's a very nice, comfortable shoe. If you're into new balances, this is something that you have to have in your collection. It's a nice piece to have. It's a nice shoe. The inspiration behind it, the comfort on it. The comfort is literally, I would say, Mm, be realistically like an eight, eight out of ten. Very comfortable. Um, can't really complain. You can wear this like all day if you're at Disney and you're there from like open to close. Uh, your feet would probably would wouldn't be complaining because um, these are very comfortable shoes. Uh, yeah. Other than that, yeah, this is a nice looking sneaker. It does come with some uh, accessories and a cool uh, box art. So I want to show you that. So. The box comes in like this. It's pretty cool. Has a shoe on there. New Balance. Here you go. And um, when I open it, it does come with a dust bag that I will show you more in depth. It has a dust bag. Uh, these are the insoles that do come with the shoe and also comes with an extra two pairs of laces It comes with a white and then like a beige like a beige color as well So you can lace swap them to beige or white depending on what do you want to? You know wear that day and how you want to lace swap them um, so I'm gonna put these on feet for y'all and I'm gonna show you how they look on feet and then I'm gonna give you more of an in-depth of how the packaging the shoe and more of a crystal clear look of how the sneaker looks okay and uh, thank you for stopping by and stay tuned towards the end of the video thank you mm -hmm.